Hey, in this video we'll be discussing the Ryobi 40 volt cordless backpack blower. Hey, if you like videos on product reviews, camping, dirt biking, go ahead and subscribe, click that like button, and make sure you click the bell to be notified of new content. Let's get started. Hey YouTube, this is Robert from Sherburn Outdoors. Hey, today we're going to do a one-year review on this uh, Ryobi 40-volt cordless backpack blower. Um, I've had an Echo gas-powered backpack blower for years. Loved it. I've had a lot of trees, a lot of leaves. It cleans everything up in my yard. Uh, about two years ago, I was having some problems. I had to rebuild the carburetor. I had it for many, many years. And I had to uh, keep it in this, uh, this outbuilding. This is back there. Um, but I wanted to put it in my garage so that I could use it frequently, but I didn't want the gas smell to go with it. So I looked around and I love uh, Ryobi tools. If you've seen any of the other videos, I have lots of them. But I'd only ever used 18 volt uh, tools in the past. And I decided I wanted to move up to 40 volt. And so when I um, saw what this was, it was at Home Depot. It cost $249. There is a link up in the corner here, you can see. And I'll also put a link in the description. Uh, usually they have a couple of these in stock and they come with a uh, a five amp hour battery. I actually have two of these. But let's do a quick walk around of this. This is a great one. I highly recommend it. Um, I've had such joy with this. This thing works great. Um, it's got some great pros and it's got some great cons. One of the pros is you just uh, put a battery in like so and you click it and it's off and running. So there's no cranking up, there's no mixing of gas, there's none of that stuff. Some of the cons of this are, is I will tell you, the, 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 the two battery system, and it can't hold two if we put the second one in here like so, they don't last that long. I can do my backyard and front yard, but it's really tight um, with the battery. So if you have a bigger yard, you, you know, you'll have to load up on more batteries if, if you think this product is for you. But let's take a look around. All right, we just look around the back starting out. You know, it does say it's 145 miles an hour with 625 uh, CFM. It does have the two slots uh, for the batteries, so you can run two at the same time. I would highly recommend it. It's a very simple design. It's got the straps here at the front. Um, it does have a chest strap that comes across. Um, really easy to set these up. It's got good breathability. Um, your intake's right behind your, your area here, but there's a lot of gaps. But for the most part, all you can do with this is actually turn it on like so. And then we turn it on off, so it does have a turbo boost. If you click this, it'll kick in, and it'll go for two minutes. I'll be honest with you. I only ever use the turbo boost when it's on. I find when this isn't on, it doesn't produce as much. And then you've got this capability here where you can lock in the lever. Hey, we're going to do two tests to walk through this. The first test is I'm going to go out in the front yard, and we're actually going to blow everything off. Um, and you can see there's a lot of leaves out there, even though it's the end of the summer, fall hasn't started, every, everything's stressing out, so a lot of leaves are dried. And they're wet. So let's go ahead and knock that out, and then secondarily we will do a test on how long uh, this thing will run. We'll go ahead and power the batteries back up after we blow off the front yard, and then we'll let her rip from there. All right, see everybody in a few. Let's get started. All right, we got the backpack blower on. We got two battery packs in. We're going to go ahead and blow off the driveway. Uh, and I'm going to use the turbo boost. It's pretty much what I use all the time. Let's go ahead and get started. See, that was really quick. I'm going to go ahead and uh, do a time lapse. We'll do the whole yard. As you can see, this Ryobi 40 watt backpack blower really gets the job done. All of those leaves were wet and um, just didn't have any issues at all pushing it down. Even did part of my neighbor's yard. 
Okay, one last test we want to, or one last thing we want to do with this is actually run a test on how long it will last. Okay, YouTube, it looks like with two full batteries, five amp hours, 40 watt, 40 volts, plugged into this, going wide open on the turbo boost mode. A reset every two minutes as we move along. We got 19 minutes and 39 seconds. Well, actually, 19 minutes and 40 seconds, basically. Um, so, which is pretty good. That'll allow you to uh, wide open. Now, you're not always using it wide open as you move through. You may be going through the different modes. I personally, the way my yard's set up, I just use it wide open constantly. So, uh, that is a great review of this particular one. If you like um, these type of reviews on products or outside or dirt biking, Go ahead and subscribe to my channel. We do new content all the time. Go ahead and hit the like button, and don't forget to hit the bell to be notified of new content. Thanks for your time.